Praise the Lord, everybody. My name is Sean Henry Scott Sr. I go about by the position of Apostle and the body of Jesus Christ. And sitting here in the Bahamas, leaving Freeport on the cruise, um, I was just meditating on the fact that if I was to preach a sermon or share a word of faith on the Caribbean on a cruise ship in the Bahamas, what would it be? And since I don't know when the next time I'll be in the Bahamas, on a cruise ship in the Caribbean. I decided that I would share this um, word of faith with you concerning the, the, the innumerable possibilities of our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. Looking out here and seeing the Caribbean, I mean, we're so far from the port now, the, little, the lights are getting dimmer and dimmer, and as you can see, the sun is set, and time is drawing nigh, and um, light is turning to darkness. The sermon that I will preach and encourage anybody who are lacking the faith to believe God is to simply experience God. I challenge you to experience God this year in 2016 in any kind of way, shape, or form you've never attempted to experience Him before. Because this was a step of faith for me, not only to come to Florida with no finances and no real means of uh, sustaining myself financially, but to also believe God when I spoke. It's on one of my videos where I said, I'm gonna get on one of those ships. Cause down the street from the ministry where I'm volunteering at is the port for the cruise, cruise people. And I told, I spoke it. I said, I'm gonna get on one of them ships before I leave. I said it, I said it. And here I am a couple months, not even two months, not even a month and a half later on this cruise ship that I didn't have to pay any money my own money to get on it was provided for me and even the people who provided the, 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 the money for me didn't have the money somebody provided them with the means for it to happen and basically what i'm saying to you is that give, give god a chance to be god in your life this is just i can't even explain it you know only thing that will make this any better than what it already is is one if uh, my children was here to and grandkids was here to experience it with me i'd love to have all of them here all ten of them yes i'm counting my two stepkids even the ones that don't like me and um and the married in daughter she loves me i believe <laughs> but i'm counting them so that makes ten seven biological two step kids that was for marriage and the one married in all ten kids and three grandkids it, that would make this better because I've been to share it with them and I'm praying one day they see these videos and have the faith to do this type of stuff. And then also um, my wife, the wife that God is going to give me. The, those two things will make this better. But I am so grateful that God gave me the faith to believe that he can do exactly what he's done. And looking out here over the Caribbean and seeing how vast and how wide and how long this, oh my goodness. Every, since I'm on a cruise ship, I've never had this view before. From every angle of the eye, there's water. And I don't know how deep it is. I'm, I'm pretty sure they've tried to measure the depth and probably didn't come up with anything, but just, it's just, it's, 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 unheard, it's, it's there's no words to explain that there's a God that created the sky and all this water for us to sustain life on earth. So I just want to encourage you because in no way means it's shape. Am I special to anybody but God and those who claim to love me? Other than that, I'm a human being like everybody else who just one day decided, you know what? I'm going I'm to I'm I'm give this Jesus Christ a try and see what happens. I don't have anything else to lose because um, working there all these hours, trying to pay bills, um, child support, taking all my money, taking my income tax. I don't have nothing to lose if I just try Jesus Christ and see what he can offer me better than what I'm trying to do for myself. And that's all I want to say to you. You know, you hear sermons that are dogmatic or people getting rebuked or you're going to go to heaven and you're going to go to hell. You hear stuff like that. Look, I'm a regular dude with real, regular real problems like everybody else. And God has given me the faith and the courage to believe him that he can do things like this. My name is Sean Henry Scott Sr. It is February the 3rd, 2016. Uh, I don't know, it's maybe six or seven, maybe six, seven o'clock. And just try God for yourself. Um, this ocean is living proof that He is who He says He is.